And it's absolutely beautiful. Just got the aircraft out of a fresh 100 hour inspection and we're good to go. So let's do three steps on a successful lift to a hover. Let's go give it a try. We're gonna get the Enstrom fired up here. And here we go. Clear left, clear on the right. All right, we're gonna engage the clutch. All right, here we go everybody. We're gonna talk through three steps of a good pickup to a hover. Step number one is to get the aircraft line in the skids. In the Enstrom, we start at 2300 on the RPM. Start letting the collective come up. You're gonna hear a horn. Okay, so the horn's off. So what I'm gonna do first is I wanna get the aircraft light on the skids. So I'm kinda looking outside, back inside, looking outside, back inside. There, the aircraft's getting light. So step number one is get it light. Once you get it light, then you wanna pause and neutralize all movements. What's the nose doing? Is the nose wanting to go a little bit to the left? Is the nose wanting to go right? Do you feel the nose going down, the nose coming up? Make those adjustments. Once you're light, make those adjustments. Get everything where you want it. Get confident that the aircraft's gonna come up straight. Then, step number three, is to just gently lift the aircraft up. And you all get a chance there to see the instrument bounce that a lot of you may have never heard of or never seen. That's what the instrument does when it, when you get it light, it starts bouncing around and a lot of guys want to rush through a pickup because they don't want to feel that bounce, but it's just part of flying an instrument and it's not really a big deal. So, so there you go. So there's your three steps for a successful lift to a hover. So now, the other thing I want to mention is, when I was training as a new pilot, flew with the young CFI and he did a great job and and every so often had to fly with the senior guy. And he would always kind of come in and, you know, kick your butt and whip you into shape and make sure that the younger guy's doing what he's supposed to. And I'll never forget him taking me in after a flight lesson and saying, now listen to this. You gotta be careful lifting this thing up. And he called it a two-step process. Get the aircraft light in the skids, pause neutralize, and then gently lift the aircraft into the air. And I've never forgot him saying, experienced pilots roll these helicopters over from not using a good process picking the aircraft up rushing the pickup so if you like this please click the like button hit the share button please leave comments with feedback thanks for stopping by 20 day 27 and we will see you on day 28 thanks a lot we'll see y'all later